From the Council of St. Peter's Episcopal Church, Honolulu, Hawaii, a moment of music. Therefore I tell you, do not worry about your life, what you will eat or what you will drink, or about your body, what you will wear. Is not life more than food and the body more than clothing? Look at the birds of the air. They neither sow nor reap nor gather into barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not of more value than they? And which of you, by worrying, can add a single hour to your span of life? And why do you worry about clothing? Consider the lilies of the field, how they grow. They neither toil nor spin. Yet I tell you, even Solomon in all his glory was not clothed like one of these. But if God so clothes the grass of the field, which is alive today and tomorrow is thrown into the oven, Will he not much more clothe you, you of little faith? Therefore, do not worry, saying, What will we eat, or what will we drink, or what will we wear? For it is the Gentiles who seek all these things, and indeed your heavenly Father knows that you need all these things. But seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you as well. So do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will bring worries of its own. Today's trouble is enough for today. Let us pray. God of goodness, I come into your presence so aware of my human frailty, and yet overwhelmed by your love for me. I thank you that there is no human experience that I might walk through where your love cannot reach me. If I climb to the highest mountain, you are there, and yet if I find myself in the darkest valley of my life, you are there. Teach me today to love you more. Help me to rest in that love that asks nothing more than the simple trusting heart of a child. Amen. <laughs> 